Yeah, the dress is giving me very under the seat, but not in a right way, okay? Under the leg. Very under the leg. Let's go. What's good? What's poppin'? It's your boy Denzel Diana. Welcome back to my channel. Are you poppin'? Because I know I am, okay? I am back with another video, yes. And as you guys can see by this title, this is going to be another prom video, yes. I kicked off my prom season videos last week. If you guys did not check that, click the link in the description below. Or just go back and just go watch it. For this video, as you guys can see by this title, I am going to be judging my subscribers' prom dresses. Because for some reason, I didn't ask you guys to send it to me, but y'all for sending me your prom dresses, like, put me in a video. Hundreds of people have been, like, sending me their prom dresses. And I'm like, oh my god, damn, you know what? I might as well just do this video anyways. Like, okay, I gotcha, y'all want me to review your dresses, and she will be reviewed. Okay, now just because I'm judging my subscribers does not mean y'all safe, nobody is safe, okay? So, I said what I said, I meant what I said, and I said what I meant. Sweetie, and if you don't like it, bitch, kick off. And I just really wanna say to the people who sent me their dresses, thank you so much, okay, for watching my videos, for really messing with me, for really, you know, really being here for me. Like, I really do appreciate that. Like, if you really do subscribe to me, I adore you. Thank you so much for subscribing to me, because you guys know I keep surreal. Some people can't take the heat, but you guys can, so thank you. Um, I have an announcement in this video. Now, let me say my announcement song that I used to say in the YMCA. Announcements, announcements, announcement. Okay, that's actually so ugly. But no, um, I have a big announcement. I really want to do a prom makeover, so I'm making it happen. If you live in the LA area, okay, I'm so sorry if you don't live in LA and you live across the country, but what I'm not about to do is take a flight. Okay, maybe maybe next time. I really do want to just give someone the best prom of their life, because you know some people don't have the money to buy what they want to buy. You know, it's just a whole lot of lot of, and I really do get that because I wasn't always like this. A bitch used to be broke. But I just really want to help somebody who actually is really struggling with confidence, who doesn't know where to wear the prom. They just can't have the prom that they want that they dreamt up because of certain circumstances. And I'm here to change that, sweetie, okay? Now, um, if you are a subscriber and you live in LA, send me a picture of you, send me your story of why I should help you go to prom, okay? Now, this is what I'll be helping with. Let me get to the deets, okay? For this prom makeover, okay, I will take you to get your nails done. Your toes need to be done. The toes need to be pedicured. We need all the dead skin off. Your hair, I already have a hair person. Girl, you need inches, I got you. I already have a hair person, hair covered on me. You don't need to pay for shit. You don't need to pay for anything. Go, I got you, I got you, okay. Hair will be done, makeup will be done. I already have a hair person, I have a makeup person, and I will be buying a prom dress. If you already have a prom dress that you wanna wear, kudos to you. But if you don't and you need help, I got you. I got you with a prom dress, I got you with hair, I can do everything. I might even drive you to prom. Send your picture and your story to this email right here, helpmedenzel at gmail.com. I repeat, helpmedenzel at gmail.com. This is only if you live in the LA area. When I mean LA, I don't mean California. I mean Los Angeles, Los Angeles. I'm not going to no San Jose. I'm not going to San Francisco. I'm not going to no San Diego. I said Los Angeles, okay? But to enter this, okay, you must be subscribed to me. I will be checking. You must follow me on all my social medias and your post notifications must be on on everything. Cause sweetie, you just not going to come across this video just get this chance if you're not a subscriber, if you're not a darling, if you're not that bitch. So yeah, um, I wanna do a prom makeover and it's gonna happen. Hey dog, okay now let me really shut up and Okay, now let me really shut up. Let me really shut up and let's get right on into this video. I am so sorry, but she had to be sad. Hey, Johnny, if this is your first time seeing my face or no, of my existence, please click that subscribe button. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. That helps me a lot. If you are watching this video right now, stop this video and give this video a big fat thick thumbs up. Okay, let's try to get this to like 40K likes. If we can, then I'll make a part two. A part two, not a part four. A part two. Without further ado, let's get right on into this video. Shall we, darling? I am having a bad hair day. She's very slanted, she's very obtuse angle, she's very in a cute angle, she's very 90 degrees. I will say, for some reason, a lot of people kill prom this year. Like, my subscribers, like, y'all know what y'all doing. Like, I, I'm not gonna lie to you. I try to look for some, like, dresses that are just not working. There was some that I'm like, Oh my God, y'all are actually so cute. Now for the first dress I am reviewing, um, this is this girl who sent me her photo. She's like, Denzel, please review me. And this is actually so cute, so simple. I live for a sequence, okay? This doesn't give you cheap, cheap sequence that you be seeing that just looks very homemade, you know? She gives you life, okay? Pink, come on girl, chocolate, I love. Come on girl, I love a chocolate skin with a bright dress color. This is beautiful, come on train, come on Met Gala. From a one to 10, I would give this dress a solid eight. I love the beading, I love everything. The only thing that I feel like she should have done 
was if she has a simple dress, you have to accessorize. Like she had, a, she should have had a, like a nice little diamond, like you know, necklace or not a cute necklace. You know what I mean? Necklace would have would have done or a cute like bracelet or a bracelet would have done. I don't know. I just feel like the dress is cute, but it's very simple. So she needs something to like you know to really. Poop. And now for this dress, um, this girl sent me this dress, and it is a what? It looks very. It looks. It looks very cashmere, like the the fabric of it. I don't know, but it is this plain dress with you know just the crisscross straps with the over the neck. And this dress is cute. It's actually too simple for me. I feel like, yet again, this is a very simple dress, but it's not giving me like accessories. If you're going with a very simple dress, girl, you need to over accessorize. You need accessories, okay? You need to really be glammed up. Hair was just very straight down. Or she should have done something crazy with her hair. If you have a simple dress, you have to do like, at least give her a curl. Don't give me a straight. Or if you want to give me a straight, give me inches. You know what I mean? I love the whole look of this. I have to give this dress a 7.5. Now, I'm judging overall just not the dress, but the dress mainly. You feel? You feel. However, what may have made this dress pop really is if she did an updo, if she did an updo with her hair, or if she just accessorized. That's it. Okay, and now for this third dress. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Give me homemade Met Gala. Now, with this dress, um, a white dress to prom, and it's very plain. It just sometimes it gives me wedding, but not wedding like in a good, good way. But however, She's very fierce. I could hardly tell by her pose, her stance, and her hair. She's fierce. I'm living, I'm loving this confidence that's in this photo. This dress, it's cute, but for some reason I always come back to this. It's giving me very bedding. But however, it's giving me rich bedding, okay? Bedding that rich people use in their house and their mansions. Not in an IKEA bedding, bitch. It's giving me a very, what's an expensive brand? It's giving me very Z Gallery bedding. It has a little cute designs in it. And the cute little lace-up shoe, I like it. It's very plain, but to me, it works. I don't know why. I don't know why it's the way she's posing. This does give me very bed sheet, though. It gives me very bed sheet mixed with wedding. But however, it's the way she's wearing it that makes it for me a eight. If I saw this dress on someone who's just like slouching and stuff, I'd be like, girl, a three. But look at her pose. Look at her hair. Look at her makeup. Look at the way the leg is out. She knows what she's doing. The dress I'm not a big fan of is just the way she's carrying herself in it, which gave me an eight. I feel like whenever you wear a white dress, you have to wear like like a colored hair. She had like a red heel, bitch, with some nice, you know, some nice jewelry. Oh, she could have really, bam. Okay, and now this dress. Okay, this is a two-piece dress. Yeah, I know how I feel about two-piece dresses. This is a two-piece dress with a cover over. I don't know how to feel about this dress. This dress, it gives me prom, but then it gives me very kinsey at the same time. I like the color of the dress. I just still don't like how it's two-piece. I don't know why, I just don't like how it's two-piece. And I don't like the bra thing that's under. Even though I know it's supposed to be there, it just looks very awkward. I do live for the designs on the dress, but she's giving very quinceanera, she's giving very that episode from This Is Way We Place when you know she had the big poofy dress. This is very sweet 16. For me, this is giving me very princess Halloween costume, you know what I mean? I will have to make this dress a seven overall. She looks very pretty in the dress. I, however, I just don't like types of dresses like this. I'll give this a solid seven. Yeah, it's just too continued for me. It's too childish for me. I don't know why it's so childish for me. It just, it gives me too princessy. What you do want to feel like a princess on prom. And now, this dress. Okay, this is a red plain dress with some, you know, give you a little ruffle, like a big ruffle at the end. This dress is cute, but it is simple. If you're gonna go with a simple dress, okay, these are all simple ass dresses. If you're gonna go with a simple dress, you have to give me accessories, okay? This dress is very simple. Her hair is very regular. I could tell that this dress was designed for her. Um, I like the dress, but it's just too, too plain. Like, she's giving me plain realness. Like, when I say plain, I mean plain, but this is like over the top plain, plain. What is up with y'all with all these plain dresses with no accessories? Sweetie, diamonds, necklaces. Give me something, give me chains, okay? Give me body art, body paint, give me something. The end gives it something. It doesn't give it everything, it gives it something. I like the way how the bottom is structured and everything, but however, the top of the dress, like, where her breasts are, I feel like it looks like she cut it herself. It looks very cardboard cutout. As I'm zooming in, it's not like all around the way. It's like very like, I don't know how to cut with scissors. So you know when you cut something with scissors, when you cut a cardboard with scissors, and you see the different chops? That's what it looks like. It's giving very arts and craft at the top. But overall, I like the dress, but the breast area, it doesn't look even. It looks very like, like she cut it herself. I don't know why. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to give this dress a six, just because, of the way the top is. Okay, and now we have this girl who sent me her pictures. Her name is, you see her Instagram is actually here. Tyla, Tyla, okay. Girl, you're giving me black Cinderella. I love this, I love this. Go on with your natural hair. This is so magical to me. I love this dress. Yes, bitch. Yes, the gold gloves, the gold clutch. 
Yes! I love this. This dress is so sparkly and cute. I love this dress. I do. I can't really see her shoes, but I really don't care for her shoes because the dress already gave it to me. Her hair is so cute. I feel like I should have did this with like a nice like bob weave or whatever. It would have looked okay. But just the fact that her hair is natural and curly, she gives me very black Cinderella. Come on, Melanin Queen. I live! I live! I really do like this dress. I would give this in the whole overall, you know, concept a 9.5. Excellence, black excellence, black Cinderella. Give it to me, bitch. You did it, you did it, you really did it. It's not like a cute, like, Insta Baddie prom dress, but it's giving you very royalness. It's giving you luxurious bitch. It's giving you Queen Elizabeth at the same time. And now we have this girl who sent me her dress. Now, I was really trying to understand this dress. I've been trying to understand this dress, for, and I just can't quite seem to get it. It is a blue arm break. It goes from blue to light, the blue to light to blue. This dress is giving me very aquamarina, very aquamarine, it's giving me very under the sea, very aquarium. I am not a big fan just because of, I feel like it's just not structured at all. Like right here it's structured, but I feel like the end just let go, just let loose. I don't like the bottom of the dress. It looks too heavy. Like it just looks like it's drooping. It doesn't have any structure at all. It doesn't have any structure at all. Her neck, I feel like it's too much and it doesn't go with the dress. If she's going with like, this is very like under the sea magical, I feel like that's what she was going for. I don't know what she was going for, but if that's what she was going for. I feel like the necklace should have been very more simple. Like, I'll have to give this dress a solid 5.5. Yeah, the dress is giving me very under the seat, but not in a right way, okay? Under the leg, very under the leg. Now, now, I do like the top of the dress. It's just the bottom of the dress that I just don't get. It just felt like it was very structured, and then she just let go. She said, I'm tired, I give up. The dress said, bitch, let me just fall down. Okay, and now, this was sent in my DM. This is a boy. I know this is prom dresses, but I feel like I never really put boys in my prom videos, so. Whatever, equality, right? <laughs> okay, so this boy had um, a blazer on. I feel like a blazer on. It's like very a Prince Charmer blazer, but then he decided to do very something like very customized to put a train on it. Now, I don't know how to feel about this. Now, I see what he was going for, however, I feel like he didn't hit the mark. I live for the extraness. The extras, I give it a 10, because bitch, train, give me a train, give me buses, give me vehicles, give me length. I love length. Give me Mets Gala. I feel like this wasn't the type of right train to go with this blazer. It just looked very uneven. Even. It's, it, it, it was just not supposed to be there. If you're gonna give me a chain, give me a chain that, it would've been nice if the chain was a part of the coat, like if it's the same coat fabric, not like a different blazer with like a different veil, like, no. For the extras, a 10. For the actual blazer, I'll give it a six and a half. It's just feel like it just grew out of his ass, you know what I mean? It just didn't flow. It didn't match. I see, I, I see the vision. However, the vision wasn't clear. I give this a 6.5. The extras, I give this a 10, cause bitch be, Give it to me, okay? I don't like two-piece dresses. I always say if it's a two-piece dress, it has to look cute, but this is a, such a cute two-piece dress. When you do a two-piece, do a two-piece dress like this. Girl, come on, Royal Blue, come on, Royal. I live for this two-piece. I do, I really do, I don't know why. I love the top, I love how it's a cute little crop thing with a velvet, nice skirt. We'll give it, it doesn't have a train, but you know, it has, it covers the toes, and that's cute when it covers the toes. I love it, I give this dress a 8.5. I, I love it, royal blue, come on bitch, give me royal. Give me my school uniform, my school uniform is this color, come on. Okay, and now the next girl, we have another girl with a royal blue dress. I like this dress, but then I don't. Okay, I like the dress, the dress could be cute, but I feel like she didn't accessorize at all. Girl, I don't even see a crochet. Girl, um, this dress is very plain, and there's no accessories, not even one necklace on, not, nothing. It's just a dress and a shoe. This doesn't look like she's gonna promise. This dress doesn't give me promise, give me very graduation. This is something you wear under your cap and gown, okay? If I saw this dress, I would be like, oh my god, girl, you just graduated? This dress is very plain, although it does have styling to it. It's just not a plain blue dress. Like, look at the way the chest is, like how it goes in, that deep V, I, I, I live for it, I do. This dress just doesn't give me anything. She, she doesn't give me anything, she just gives me blue C. I will give this dress a six. And her shoes are cute, but for some reason they give me very bondage. Don't know why. Okay, now we have this couple, okay, and all I just see is just bridal. Flowers, daffodils, tulips, and roses. All types of flowers, bitch, that you know in this picture. The girl, I'm not a really big fan of floral, so already like, you know, you already know how I feel about floor. It has to be a cute type of floor pattern. This is cute, however, it's just giving me just big red flowers everywhere. I don't really feel it. What's really doing it for me is the black simple thing, okay? I love how it's just black, the belt, the floral. However, this is not giving me problem again. It's giving me very spring formal, you know what I mean? It gives me graduation dress. I don't know why. The boy, yeah, y'all both have flowers, but I feel like if she had this much of flowers on her thing, he should have just wore all black with like a red bow tie or like a red flowery bow tie. If he had an all black suit on, okay? with a bow tie that was the same 
pattern as her dress, it would have been cute. It would have been like, oh, this is cute. Floral matching cute. But his flowers just didn't mix with her flowers, and it just doesn't look okay to me. The scarf was a bit too much. You can't have the best of both worlds, my brother. You either have to have the scarf on with a black shirt or this on with no scarf. So yeah, I'll give this a five. Okay, overall, this picture's a five. Him, I'll give him a five. Her, I'll give her a six. And now I don't see this whole dress. This girl sent me this picture, but I don't see her whole dress, but this is all I need to see. This is a solid nine. Yes, queen. Black sequence in the right, not even a nine, 9.5. I love this. I love this dress. Yes. This is what I'm talking about. You see a simple dress with the diamond bracelet. Yes, with a red bow lip. Give me curls. I love this. I don't need to see the bottom to know. I would love this dress. This dress is actually so beautiful. I love the way it covers like her breast area, how this is open. This is a sexy dress. This dress is a nine, 9.5. It's a 9.5. It's so good. Look at the way the back is shaped. The back is crisscrossed too. I love this dress. I love everything about this dress. I love the way it fits her midsection. Stomach on flat, flat. Yes. Uh, yes, girl. Uh, um, this girl sent me her dress in. And it's different, but however, I feel like it would do for me for prom. It's a green, plain dress and a gold band. This gold band is giving me very Wonder Woman though. It's giving me very Marvel, very DC, very DC Comics, very comic book. It's place is very weird. And I feel like it's weird just because of the way the sides are cut out. I don't know. I'll give this a six. This dress is very Yanni and Laurel. Bitch, I'm confused. Confuzzled. I live for Wonder Woman, but not for prom. She needs to save the world, okay? So we need to take off the gold band, and however, sister dress is so, so plain. She should have done like one of those fur, Scarf thing. She, she had a little white furry, you know, scarf thing just over her shoulders like this. Yeah. White or a black. Ooh, black and green look so nice together. Or if it was a black fur little scarf thing, she damn it would have so good. But the gold band is enough for me. Okay, and now for this dress. I really do like this dress. I don't know why. It's very simple and it has flowers and stuff on it, but it's actually cute. It's not It's not a bad looking dress. I actually do like this dress. It's a white dress, but this doesn't give me wedding dress. You know what I mean? Like sometimes people give me white dresses, give me wedding dress. The thing is like, it gives me wedding dress, but not like a real wedding dress when people wear white. But I love this. This is actually so cute. I love how the flowers are placed. They're placed in subtle parts that just accentuate her body, accentuate the way the dress is. I love the way the dress sits on the floor. However, the necklace, doesn't match with this. It should have been something that was very tight like this. I'll give this a 7.5. And now for the last dress, okay, there are so many dresses, but this is the last dress, okay? If you guys want a part two, thumbs it up, sweetie, thumbs it up, boo. I can't really see the whole, whole dress, but I'm judging off this. I can see enough to judge, you know what I mean? I love the black shimmery, give me black shimmery Hollywood glamour. I love the way this dress is like, it's not like a tight dress, it's like, it's like a baggy but fitted dress. However, I love the way the chest is out. And I love for this, I love her blonde hair, how it's just curled. Her crochet, this is very magical to me. It's, give, it's giving me galaxy, Pluto, Saturn, bitches. Space, bitch. Very cyberspace. And I live. I really do live. I'll give this an A. Girl, you look so magical. This is giving me magician, bitch. Houdini. Guys, that was your prom dresses, and I judged, okay? You guys really did good. And if I don't really like your dress, it is all good. If you like your dress and you stepped out and you are so proud of how you look, you think you are that bitch, then you are that bitch. If you look bomb, you feel bomb, then bitch, you are bomb. Don't care what I have to say. I am a nobody. Don't care what I have to say. Do you, mama. Do you, sweetie. Do you, boo-boo. Because I'm not wearing that dress. You are, so you own it. That was it for this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. If you liked it, like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like I said, you see me. I'm doing it. You watch, I post. You don't watch, I don't post. So watch, and until then, see you later, my darlings. Bye, toodaloo!